Hey Planner Babes, welcome back to another brand new video. I'm so excited that you guys are here today. If you wanna follow me, you can do so on Facebook, Instagram, Pinterest, and TikTok using at Amy. Don't forget to hit the subscribe button and the notification bell so you never miss another brand new video from me. Let's get into the video. Hey Planner Babes, welcome back to another plan with me here on my YouTube channel. Now for today's video, we are planning in my month at a glance, or my monthly planner, excuse me, and I only use these two pages as you know, but I wanted to show you some stuff I got from the recent Happy Planner haul, not very big, but I ordered um, two sticker books when they had their sale, buy one, get one, I think like 50% off, or it was like some deal, it was like you got one planner and you got one, oh, buy one, if you bought two, you got 20% off, like if you bought like uh, three or more you got 20 uh 25 percent off and then i think something like that so i bought two sticker books um but i want to show you what i got in my order first i want to show you the super cute um little die cut sticker that they gave this one is really cute um i was gonna put it on a phone case but i used pop sockets on my phone case and it would to fit this on my phone it would hide most of it so um i don't know where i'm gonna put this but i think it's super cute and I like that they gave this one. And then the two sticker books I got, I'll show you the first one, which is the one I'm gonna use in today's video. I got the Papillon, um, I'm not pronouncing it properly, I should pronounce it, Papillon, I can speak French. So this is the um, Papillon sticker book, which is a really great one. I think it is so pretty and fun. And when they first came out with this one, I think this was in the fall release of 2021. Um, it wasn't available in Canada and it was at the time really expensive to order on the Happy Planner website So I didn't buy it um, But then when they had the deal I saw this one I was like I will get it Because um, I really like it and then I've been eyeing this one for a while um, Or like this from this collection the Disney one I like that this is neutral so you can kind of add your own color if you want to it's pretty neutral It's got some pinks and blues um, But I would say overall it's like pretty subtle where you can kind of add your own color in your own way um, and this is really great if you're doing like a rainbow spread and just want to do Disney, but none of the other Disney sticker books work. There's a lot of neutral black and white stickers that you can add. So this is super fun. So yeah, um, I also bought these because recently I discovered that you can actually um, shop in Canadian dollars on the Happy Planner website, which is so cool. So thank you to the Happy Planner for that. Um, even though, you know, you're still paying the same price as if you were shopping on the in American dollars on the website, you don't have to do that mental conversion anymore which is so important um that you don't have to do that which i think is really cool so these are the two that i got from my haul plus a little die cut sticker that they give so really happy um and i got this order pretty quickly it's the fastest order i've ever gotten from the happy planner i ordered it on monday um last monday which was monday the august something and today we are monday august 29th and I received it so it only took about a week to get here which is beyond fast for the happy planner I've never had an order from them come that fast it's usually anywhere from like two to three weeks for me I don't look out for it for more than like around the two week mark so looking out for it but I didn't expect it to come so soon so I'm really happy about that so without further ado I'm going to do the papillon sticker book um yeah so the main stuff is this area is decorative, this area is decorative. This is just like to-dos. This is the, um, my work schedule area. This is like any bills or appointments, which I'm probably not gonna have this month. I usually have an appointment that I do every three weeks, but it's not been in the budget lately and I've been not doing it. So I'm kind of good not needing to do it. So that's pretty good. So this is usually where I track um, some appointments um, because usually appointments slash like cost because some appointments have cost with them So it usually goes here like cost stuff like um, rent and um, like monthly bills that get taken out of my account So yeah, there's that So yeah, let's do it And I have a few things like car insurance and stuff like that some I tend to use um, a cluster of smaller stickers, uh, functional sticker boxes here. Also, birthdays go here as well. And then, like, top priorities is, like, different things. Like, I want to finish a book this month. Um, so, yeah, 
September. Mm. This one was so pretty when I saw it, and I was like, oh my goodness, I have to have it. Um, but it wasn't available in Canada, and in, sometimes it's expensive to order from the Happy Planner website. But when stuff is on sale, sometimes it can be a really good deal. And both of these together were $40, which is cheaper than a um, sticker book available at Michael's. Because Michael's, the sticker book prices um, vary. I think it's anywhere from $19.99 to $26.99, if I'm not mistaken. They went up in price. It all used to be $16.99. And now I've noticed that a lot of the older, older ones... Uh, from like spring 2021 and beyond tend to be around 1999 not 100% guarantee and then the ones from like kind of like the fall uh, 2021 release tend to be about 21.99 and then newer releases tend to be around 24.99 that's not a guarantee that's just what I've noticed in the pattern and um just a note I don't know what it's like in every store but I I work at Michael's so I can tell you a little bit about what it's like in mine um but if you're struggling to find your happy planner section yeah it is very possible that it was taken out of the aisle and that it will be moving um don't worry i don't think the happy planner is leaving it's like the only planner brand at michael's they don't do the michael's recollection planners anymore so like don't worry about that uh the happy planner i is i don't think is leaving um it's moving just that's what i have to say it's pretty much as far as i know that is moving. I know in our store it moved out of an aisle onto a little thingy. Um, but I'm pretty sure. Like, the Happy Planner is, like, super popular. So, I just don't see it um, leaving. I really like this color. And I'm going to layer it with another book. I want to do something here. I really like this one. And I might actually do it this way. Because I want... So it's like sometimes when I'm doing boxes with two decorative elements inside it, like this is floral, this is floral. I like them to be on opposite sides. Like if they're on the same side, I'm not always a fan of that. So um. probably October's um, monthly plan with me. We'll have a little bit more stuff on it because I'm going to a wedding and I'm taking a few days off for that so I'm I need a box for my um work schedule and I just I want one that's I could actually I never know how to use these here and I could totally do that I would need um I'm just gonna take a quick peek at the month of September because I'm just to figure out what I um September what I'm doing in regards to like so the one two three four because I always do the last week that's like overlapping the last week that is like usually a combo month I tend to do whatever is the first month of that week so like September then that will go into like September um, I'm probably gonna try to use some of these I like the pink one and the blue and this one I don't know if this is enough space to write I feel like it's not but I want to see Not enough, so I'm gonna. I'm it's not gonna work what I want to do, so I'm just gonna place these ones back. Ooh, that's crooked, and that's not good because when I want to go use it again, it's gonna rip. I just know that. That's a no for right there. Okay, I need a bigger one. So 
this one's really pretty and it has enough space for probably two weeks because i and i like that it's dot grid which works that i like dot grid because it just gives you actually more space than lined grid um than lined I'm thinking putting, I need, I'm thinking I could do bullet points for the rest of the week actually. So, uh, I wish it was like a long skinny box. Sometimes that would be nice. video is like not too long okay we're already at 11 minutes and i've only gotten three stickers down that's not good um, i think i want to do bullet points for the rest i just don't know where i want this like i could put this in the center which is what i was thinking of doing like this and then do bullet points like all around with like things on top. I'm gonna do those bullet points. I haven't really done that before and I think it would be nice. I want the headers. I like the too busy because it's like perfect since I'm working. And I also like the plans one, but I want the same one on each side, I think. And I'm gonna alternate the colors for the bullet points. Um, like pick, like try to use all the different colors. Um, I'll double check on that actually. I only need five days. Yeah, there's eight, so. Well, I think this one is kind of a repeat of that one, but yeah. I'm probably gonna do this one, this one, this one, yeah. I don't know if we'll do this one. I'll do like one of these two, but not both, probably. Let's see. Um, okay, so that's kind of done in that. I want a quote though, a long quote maybe at the bottom. So I like either dream big or this one. I feel like this one is really long. Oh, it's longer than dream big, I think. Yeah, it's a little bit longer, so I think it'll work. No, just be like simple, you know? I think I want to do, um, I know this is a bit off, but I think I want to do a floral element in one of these boxes, and I don't know if I want it to be, I think I want it to be one of these. Because I don't know if I want one of these. I wish I could get this one, but going the other direction. I mean, I could still do it. No, it's too tall. Okay, I need a shorter floral element. I'm just gonna take a peek at the back and see what there is. If there's another like area with like a floral element.
put him on a little butterfly and a quilt with it. I just don't want to do one of these. I'm going to add a butterfly on top of the floral element that I'm doing. I don't like it 100%. I could like totally cut it off more. like that there a bit so I'm gonna do that I feel like this side is basically done I might just add something here maybe another quote This side is done. I'm gonna just move on to this side. I like these here, and I like this one on the black and white. But I also like this one too. I'll go for this one. Over here. I'll definitely add washi. I'm gonna lay a washi but I'm gonna put this right around there. Washi. Yeah, Thing like that. And I'm gonna add a butterfly in the boat area for sure. This one is just too big. I don't know if they're smaller. Like, I think this one might be slightly smaller. So I'll go for this one. Let's 
fiery, I think. I want it on the opposite side, actually. Like that, maybe? I'll do it like this. Yeah. There we go, and then I want a decorative element. These are really pretty. But another day for that. I like this one. And mm, this one a lot. But this one too. I think I'm going to go for this one. I could add some more butterflies to it. Like I could layer it. Yeah. Mm. I like the idea of layering it with this maybe. So was this one going the other direction? There isn't. Something like that, and then I think a quote on the top one. I just like the simple, like, heart of gold one. This needs more quotes in it, that's all I have to say. Maybe a floral element to
I'm just gonna show the small and the cool. I could do another butterfly though, actually, and not take one of the big quotes. Just another sticker book for a quick quote. I just have to pick which butterfly I want. I like this one. And I like this green butterfly. It's just so freaking pretty. Go about of just quotes. Yes, I don't believe in zodiac signs, but I bought this sticker book because I like the quote stickers and stuff. Um, yeah, so. Oh, it's a little big. Yeah, it's a little too big, maybe. So. That's it. This sticker was actually really pretty because I like the fonts and the stuff and the stars. Um, so I think that works. I'm just gonna stick with that quote. And, okay, and then I think I'm just gonna add washi to the spread. And I am. Oh, this video is so long. Oh yeah, I need the bullet point page so that I can pick the bullet points when I need them. Gonna leave this open. Mm, yeah, gonna do this. Okay. This. I'm gonna layer two washies. I like this one. It's the first time I'm actually not using one of my own washies in a spread. Um, one of my own from like my brand. Because I felt like this one would be better because it wouldn't be like the harsh black and white. Which I really like my black and white striped washi. I use it in so many spreads. 
that I literally am almost done the roll and yeah. So. really good. Okay. And then at the bottom. hard to plan in this plan in this layout I really like it but and I and I do think it's it's super fun but I'm not gonna deny that sometimes it is hard said busy. Whoops. I just realized it says to buy. I don't know why I thought it said busy. <sighs> um, and I don't need to buy anything, so I'm gonna put those back and maybe change it with the to do. bullet points after, I think.
I like the look of that. Just kind of like sitting on the thingy. Um, okay, that's that. Oh yeah, and then lastly is bullet points and then potentially, ooh, sorry. That was loud. And then um, potentially more washi, so. I'm gonna do the same on the other side. I might just have it go the... Mm, I think symmetry, so... I didn't put the sticker in the right spot, so. And then I think that this is it. I might just add some washi down here. And I'm gonna add some of this washi as well. this is it for the spread i think that is done it looks good sorry that the video is long i'm gonna try to find ways that i can like cut it down but if i can't i am sorry that this video is long i still hope that you enjoyed it and enjoyed this spread i think it looks so fun i should have put this stuff a little higher but i kind of like this layout i think it looks really good i'm gonna write in it eventually and then we'll see if this looks good written in but until the next uh video bye planner babe oh uh, before I actually say goodbye, I want to say that you can follow me at Planner Girl Amy on Instagram as well as my washi tape brand at Wonder Washi Tape on Instagram. And you can also um, shop it on Etsy. So it is wonderwashi.etsy.com. So until the next one, Planner Babes, bye.